because I think for me, for example, being an empath, which you are too, obviously you've just said that, um, sometimes we don't discern or we're not sure which energy belongs to us, which energy is our own, which energy belongs to someone else and be able, being able to differentiate that is you have to be really self-aware of how it is you feel. And then the minute that changes, noticing whether or not there's some kind of outside influence. So yeah, like how did you even become a, I, I know you said you picked up on, on your partner's energy, but you would think that your rational mind would almost go, oh, I had a bad sleep or I had a nightmare or, you know what I'm saying? Because I had had a number of very profound intuitive experiences as a teenager, I knew what was going on. I just didn't okay. know how to control it. Yes. Okay. I didn't know how to dial it down. I didn't know how to be comfortable and feel safe around people, grocery stores, yes. anything like that. Yes. Took me about six months to figure out oh, the words for what I was experiencing, mm. that there was a term for this. 